Hi everyone. Hi, this is Lakshmi Prabha Gopala Krishnan. Today, what's next, Prabha? I'm going to show you all how I make donuts. The needed ingredients for that are one and a quarter cup of maida and half cup of milk and three tablespoon of sugar, one teaspoon of yeast, one teaspoon of salt, and five teaspoon of butter melted butter and little bit of vanilla essence if you need you can add otherwise you can avoid also for the decoration of the donut i have taken 100 grams of cooking chocolate dark chocolate 100 grams of powdered sugar and little bit of amul um, fresh cream and 10 badam chopped and taken and a few pistas chopped and uh, one tablespoon of zira candy. I've just chopped and powdered it and kept. In a small cup, I'm adding the yeast, sugar, and a little bit of lukewarm water. We'll just give a mix. We'll keep on the side. Okay. Now I'll just rest of the ingredients. I'll mix. I'm adding the maida, salt, and we need to use five tablespoon of melted butter. One, two, three. 4 and 5 and a drop of vanilla essence first I'll mix the, these things You can see the yeast is activated. Now I'm adding that. Now we use little by little milk as we need it. We can use the milk and make a dough like a chapati dough like that, which we should make. Now the dough is nicely mixed and it is soft and ready. Now we will just close this and I am just going to apply little bit of melted butter only on this and then I will cover this and I will keep this for 20 minutes for resting. The dough is rested 20 minutes nicely and it is very soft nicely. Now I'll just knead this by dusting little dry maida flour. Kneading this. Slightly you dust the maida flour. Then Slightly thick, I rolled it. Now I'll just transfer this to a, another 
the tray. I just keep this for resting another 20 minutes. After rolling, this is rested for almost 20 minutes. So you can see it has become a little soft. And now we'll make it into a shape. I'm using, if you have donut cutter, you can use that. Otherwise, we can use this tumbler like this something. Or we can use it something like this with the sharp lid. Just go like this and using one bottle stop in the middle I'm giving the shape. So like that I will do the rest also. As soon as we make we should remove this into Another tray dusted with the maida. I will do the rest of the donuts also, and then the the surrounded that whatever we are thinking it is waste, it is not wasted. This also we can make into a donuts. We can shape it into a donut. The oil is hot and ready. I kept in a very low flame. The donuts are ready to fry now. Slowly place one by one like this. In a low flame we need to cook. By using the knife you need to turn the other side also. Both the side we need to cook in a golden brown color. I will tell you let it cook. Our donuts are fried nicely to a golden brown color. Just taking one by one and transferring to a another plate with the tissue. It should be like this. Slowly you should cook and then it should be golden brown in color. I will fry the rest of the donuts also. Donut decoration. I'm just melting the chocolate in the double boil method. That is, I just uh, the water is boiling in one pan and just melting the chocolate in another. This means let it melt completely. Slowly it will start melting. So it's coming out. Let it uh, melt completely. Chocolate melted nicely. I'm just going to add one tablespoon of fresh cream to it to give a slight shine to it. If you don't have a fresh cream, you can use butter or plain milk also. One tablespoon to give a slight shine. Now the chocolate uh, dip is ready for the decoration. I'm just giving a nice mix. Ready. I'm just switching off the stove. The chocolate is melted nicely and it is ready. I'm just going to dip one side of the donut and I'm just placing it in one plate. I will do all the do it for the all the donuts. With the melted chocolate, we can just drizzle it like this and decorate the donuts also. It will look nice. You can even use white chocolates. And the next one with the powdered sugar. And 
two with the zero candy. This is with cut this chopped pistas. You can just decorate as you wish. Donuts are ready to enjoy. Hope you'll all enjoy my video. If you like my video, please like, share and subscribe and hit the bell icon to get the further notification of my videos, future uploads. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.